welcome back to the channel today. Uh, I'm going to be doing a Undertale boss rank. Um, so I'm just not going to waste any time. Let's just do this. At number six, we have the Pyrus. Now this is really hard to say to the brother of Sans. We all know Sans is a really hard boss. To believe that Sans is lazy, but he can dodge. Anyway, Pyrus adds something new. His blue attack. We learned that you that you have to turn when you turn blue. When there's a blue attack, that means you have to stop. But if your soul turns blue, you've lost gravity. Well, there's gravity now. So you have to jump over bones during this. It's not really hard. And his final attack is really easy. I'll just show you here. Now his final attack consumes this. So here comes another regular tap. There's long bones and short bones. And then there's this. There's these like jumpy longer shorter bones. There's the dog, there are more bones, there are more bones, there's like this bone guy riding on a whatever. Then you jump, and you can actually move the box, so you, you have to jump over that bone, fall down, and then there's a small one that's really slow, so you're just gonna jump, and that's really it. That's it's, his final attack's really easy. And number five, we have Toriel. Now, Toriel is like Papyrus, but I think a little bit harder. So first off, she has a really good attack and defense, 80 attack, 80 defense. And she has got some really hard attacks. And I forgot to add them to the Papyrus. If you get down to one HP, uh, she, what is it? Well, not she, he, Papyrus brings you down to, will bring you into the garage. And this one, if you go down to 2 HP, she'll just try to avoid, try to avoid attacking at all. <clears throat> and it's really hard, she doesn't really have final attack, she really just repeats all of her attacks. It's really easy. You can see right here when you get down to 2HP. You can kill yourself, but it's really hard. So I got my numbers wrong. We are supposed to be at number 5 now. Um. Uh, Metaton. Number 5. Um, I think Metaton is a really good favorite, good boss. And pretty hard. For new players. I, I was like. Kind of like a little sad after this. And I love like Metaton's like way he's doing this for uh, the monsters. He's not doing it. He's not doing it just for. He's doing it for the monsters. He's trying to get out of the underground to show the humans. So I think he's he's just trying to make people happy. Has anyone really thought of that? So first, you don't have to do any of his attacks. You can just. Oh, yeah, I guess you have to survive for a little bit. Uh, you need to turn them to say, you say that there's a mirror behind them, and then you turn on to the switch. Did you just do that? And we probably get to see the best thing in the game, Metaton EX. Yes, beautiful legs, beautiful arms, beautiful face, beautiful hair. And good and beautiful boss battle. <laughs> yeah. Um. So this is probably like a really cool and weird one. So the whole point you're trying this is to get eleven thousand or ten thousand. It matters on how many body parts there are. If there's, if he has all his body parts there, you want to aim for eleven thousand ratings. If you just normal play, it would be like. We'd usually get all of his, um, 
already parked away. So you'd usually be doing 10,000. You can see the ratings are low, but then you And tip, uh, if you're eating, don't eat uh, Brady and Katie's food. Also, during this typing bit, dot hot fine T cutie, and you get more than normally. You get norm more than normally. It thinks you're saying something else. But yeah, pretty fun, pretty easy boss. If you're like pretty good or like me. If it's like a first time player, oh it's ugly. <laughs> Here we have one of the best themes, Undyne, the yeah, Undyne, no, not Undyne, the yeah, Undyne, just Undyne, nice. And, let's just get right into it, she introduces a new song. So I forgot to say in Metaton's one, uh, he actually gives you the yellow soul, Undyne gives you the green soul. And the green soul basically makes you not be able to move. So you have something to block. Tip during this attack, you get some special dialogue if you don't even hit those um, first arrows. And you can. And it's how you save a little bit of time if you're doing a speedrun. Instead of just doing it normally, so. I just need to bring that out. But yeah, when you do this, it's like, she says, like, I wanted to do this via FFI, I thought you'd be like this, I'd really show how strong the monsters are, but now, I don't care, I'm just gonna, I'm not your freaking kindergarten teacher in this kindergarten. <laughs> do this, and this is like, the tech. So yeah, that's how you speed on. <laughs> so you're gonna be running away from Undyne at least three times. So yeah, and you can see I had dog salad in my dog salad in my um, inventory. I don't know why I just fell in love with dog salad. Anyway, yeah, she gives you the green soul, and you're supposed to run away from her. Pretty easy, and pretty fun. It's angry me because I don't have any Asgore footage. Yeah, can't find any more old videos. So let's just say Asgore goes here. Um, I think we're at three. So let's see what two and one are. What two and one are? Okay, so at number two, preacher sure. number two, we have Undying the Undying. Yeah. Genocide, Undyne. Yeah. I don't know what to say about her, like, I cry in the shower about her. So, yeah. What you want, what she has a good, I think she has like 99 defense with 99 attack. Or like 999, so she probably has the best stats in the game. But yeah. So Undyne brings her green green soul and red soul and she actually uses her red soul better than normal uh she usually just used it after like her final attack for one of those runaway phases so instead of just like 
bringing a spear onto the screen. She actually does some um, really good spear attacks. Spear that come on the ground, the spear that go to you, follow you, yeah. Here is probably the hardest one, and here is one. Basically just go in a circle, like this. So, at number one we have Sans. Yeah, I didn't think you were gonna think this. Yeah, no way. <laughs> Nah, it's really predictable. Sans is a really hard boss. And... Yeah. But yeah, when you're me and someone that plays Undertale and likes Undertale, you have a lot of footage when you in the genocide route because I have I didn't finish it until... It's probably like a day after I posted I beat Sans and... Genocide ending it. Because I'm recording this the same, I'm putting this on the same day because I've been laying on a lot of this footage for a long time now, and I just didn't to bring it out today or tomorrow. Is it tomorrow for me, today for you. I, I don't know how to explain it, man. Just, yeah. Sends it number one. Just, please take it. Hey, it's in card Nathaniel here. Uh, it took a long time to get all this footage out, and I was really lazy to get this out. So I hope you like this, um, video. Yeah. Hope you liked it. I think I'm gonna do really major stuff. I just put my Christmas tree up yesterday, and this is coming out today. When I'm done, let's see, it's really confusing. Anyway, hope you have a good day, good night, or good day, or good afternoon when you're watching this. See ya.